Come in, can you hear me? Hello? Is anyone there? Sorry, I just woke up from a uh, snooze. No way. Time to leave Bleak Inlet and head to the Forsaken Airfield to find that final bunker. It's gonna be a long road, but we've come this far, might as well see it through. All right, luckily uh, Bunker Alpha wasn't too far from the entrance to Bleak Inlet, so it shouldn't be too hard getting back. <sighs> I really thought this was over. I found all the bunkers they wanted me to, but now they want me to head all the way back? Jeez. Well, at least we'll get an answer to this Rudiger's Gadget Junk gonna pick up some reishi mushrooms because I uh, had a little bit too much ham last night and may have gotten myself some food poisoning. <laughs> Gotta restock that uh, that medicine, but oh, nope, that's a dead wolf. We're good. See you later, Bleak Inlet. You were pretty bleak. Whoever named these places did a pretty good job. Okay, we'll use this crappy lantern that I accidentally filled up all the way. And then once it's done, we'll leave it at the mouth of the cave maybe for the next adventurer to come by. I remember this being a really long cave. Hope I can find my way out. Okay, I think this is right. I wonder if my bunny friend is here still. Yeah, if my memory serves me right, there should be a little bunny chilling up here. Where are ya? Hope a wolf didn't get to ya. Wait, there was no- there was no bunny. That was- <laughs> Is that not supposed to happen? Alright. Forlorn muskeg. This is gonna be a big one. Okay. Well. Okay, we'll just... Plop this down. Right there. There we go. Lantern for someone else. And no sprain risk for me. Keep an eye out, keep- oh, is that a- that's a wolf, okay. We're going this way, we're good. We're not smelly. We got this. It's just over there. Now, what's the safest way to get back to that, uh, Forsaken Airfield? It's been so long, that's where I started. Should we hippity hop across the ice? It would cut out so much time. Unless I get stranded. And have to backtrack. Okay, we're going for it. We're going for it. I think I, I think I see that farmstead I stayed at a while ago. Maybe we should head in that direction. It would probably... Okay, that was behind me. We're good. We're good. Okay. Oh, damn it! Is this risky? Is this too risky? Oh my god. Okay. I I don't want to do that. I'll take my chances with the wolves. We do need to get to the railroad. If we could get to the rail line, I wouldn't have to go around this whole muskeg, but... We'll see. Don't want to go up in there. I think that's where the wolves want to be. Yeah, no. My confidence is building. I think we'll be good. Oh, I think I saw a wolf. Yeah, I see ya. Sneaky little ones. In fact, I should be looking forward. Oh, it would have been nice to get around that, but... I think we're going in the wrong direction now. We want to be going that way. And I'm going... a little bit this way. Herm. Oh. Just stay away from that wolf. Man, it's a wolfy day. I've seen about three or four so far. Yikes. Okay. Well, we'll go this way and see. Oh, is that another wolf off in the distance there? Oh, oh no. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, I might be backing out of the forlorn muskeg with a, with a gun out based on the wildlife around right now. Yikes. Okie doke. Whoa, oh, oh, no, you're good. I don't mind you. Just keep doing what you're doing. And we made it. Oh. 
Is that a... Is that a freaking bear? Oh. Okay, bear or wolf? Jeez. I mean, clearly the answer is wolf, but I'd rather have neither. Okay. This is gonna take some, uh... Some rethinking. Okay, so wolf to my right. Bear up the butt. That... We're close. We're so close. Doug, you're so close. You can do it. Heck yeah. Wow. That's a big one. That's a big boy. Oh, that's a... That's the bear's house. The bear lives in that house. Oh, okay. Or... Or... Uh-oh. Worst possibility. There's another bear. There's another bear who li- Oh, what the- What's going on over here? Wow, this would have come in handy a while ago. Eh, I'll take it now. Don't see a bear, I don't hear a bear. See a wolf. Man, I- I did some good navigating there. So far, so good. Man. Sneaky, you're like a ninja. Well, another short visit. And we're off. Have a good one. Uh, enjoyed the tower I repaired. I, uh, I assume once I get to the final bunker that I will be leaving this whole island. So again, it, it was nice to hang out with you forlorn muskeg. Broken railroad. All right. So I know when I passed through this region last, there were some wolves a howling, but I took a shortcut so I didn't have to, you know, actually see if they were here, which is, was great, great at the time, but now... Okay, let's see if we can find our way back. Wolfless. A wolfless journey. That's what I'm hoping for. Yeah, we'll just keep going up here. I think that's when we come across the, the landslide. And we'll just take a little dip off to the right here. Yeah. Okay. Is that... Or can I go any farther? I, I don't think I can. I, I'll just go... I'll go the way they want me to. I'll go the way the land wants me to. Oh, except I hear wolves. I see a wolf. Do I have to? Oh, man. Okay, we're gonna be little pooses, and we're gonna see what we can do. But worst case, Ontario, we'll just go down and deal with that wolf. Uh, I might have to just kill it. Just for safety. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Let's see. Can we do this? Looks like it's gonna work. Looks like it's gonna work. Not today, wolves. Not today. Oh, yeah. Just a little bit of hiking. And we can avoid danger altogether. That's the way you do it. That's the way you do it. Hopefully I can make it to that rail tunnel before nighttime sets in. Oh, well, I wonder what I'm gonna eat on the plane on the way back home. Chicken, fish, veggie, probably chicken. I don't trust the fish on planes, as a rule. You know, I doubt they'll give me first class, but, uh... You know, I'll take... I'll take business. But hey, what I'm most looking forward to is those little snacks they give you. Those little, those little brown, little pieces of brown bread crackers. They look like little slices of bread. That's what I'm looking forward to. Mmm. Love me some dry, stale crackers while I'm flying in the air. Almost as much as I love trudging through the snow along a broken railroad. Ugh. I think we're good. I don't think any wolves are tiptoeing across this bridge. Now comes one of the hardest parts of the journey. Okay. You got this. You got this. Okay. Alright. Heart's racing. Just gotta get through this transfer pass. And we'll be on our way to the Forsaken Airfield. Been a long time. Long time. Might need to refill my lantern, though. Wonder how dark it is in here. Oh yeah, that's pretty dark there, bud. Yeah, hopefully we see daylight on the other side. Oops, it's nighttime. We're not gonna see daylight. But 
I guess I'll have to just take... Oh, shit. Okay, I have a bedroll. We'll just have to take a rest. Okay, made it to the end of the rail tunnel. Into this spooky corridor. The spookiest of corridors. We shall be alright anywhere in this little dinky corridor. Okay. Sit down a nice little bedroll. Pop a squat on it. And, uh... Do a little stock of our inventory, just make sure everything's good to go. Take a good old sleep and hopefully we wake up and there's daylight. Still got quite a bit of journey ahead of us. Nighty night, Doug. Uh, Okie dokie. That was... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Okie dokie. Had a good sleep. Oops, nope, that was the right way. Okie dokie. Had a good sleep. And now... There should be enough daylight for for me to get through this uh, transfer pass thingy-majig. So, I'm just gonna go the same way I went the first time. Just to make sure everything's good. I don't know if there's another way, but I want to make it. Ooh, this was a steep stairwell. <sighs> just... Oh, what the fuck? Dude. I wanted to come down there. Okay, maybe I still can if I... Oh. Well, what are you gonna do, man? What are you... What are you gonna do? Like, I'm... I'm right here. Okay, this is gonna be nasty. I'm gonna have to get nasty with it. Where are ya? I'm a... I'm a bad shot. I think I got my point across. Don't mess with me! Don't mess with Doug. Or you'll get a... a warning shot, apparently. That's right. Tail between his legs. Running into walls and junk. Uh-oh. Okay, now he's sort of on the offensive again. Well, one bullet down. That's not too bad. The alternative is I get my clothes scratched a bit. Okay, one threat dealt with. Now we just gotta deal with these rabid bunnies. Bang! All right, cave number three. Let's do it. Oh, spent a lot of time in this cave. Too much time in this cave, that's for sure. On my way back from the Forsaken Airfield the first time. And maybe on the way to the Forsaken Airfield the first time as well. Oh man, I, I don't want to see this cave ever again. Okay, is this correct? This looks incorrect. Yeah, that looks... Nope, this... Okay, that's dead. Yes, correct. Did I make that? That's my fire. Ah, uh, what a good time I had. Hanging out with my friend. Oh, hey, dude, you're still here? Oh, man, it's been a long time. How you did? Uh, we always did have good conversations. Well, bud, I'll see you later. I'll send a postcard or something, but uh, probably the last time I'm going to see you. Getting the hell out of here. Okay. Made it through the plate layer shortcut. Continuing along the far range branch line. I have been attacked by a wolf on this range line of tracks. So don't want to get too complacent. Got to make sure we're aware at all times. It was right around here. Right around here somewhere. Beans? No, dog food. Okay, that's a bit sketchy. I don't want no stomach bug. Is it still there? No, it's gone. Some other wolves must have picked it up. That makes sense. Yeah, so far this has been a peaceful journey, hasn't it? Just some nice, uh, nice stroll along the train tracks. Almost took the train tracks all the way. That's pretty crazy. 
Or is it crazy? Maybe that's just a normal thing to do along train tracks. Travel along them. You know, lanterns don't really give off that much light sometimes. Kind of depends on where you are. I mean, I am going to miss some of my homes that I had here. That uh, forestry lookout in Mystery Lake, that was beautiful. Um, a, a different one that I had, that was also probably beautiful. Finally at the transfer pass. Great! You know, after such a long trek and traveling through caves, I might just want to take a quick break at this little building up ahead. Forgot how many acorn trees there were. Acorn trees? Ma maple? A elm? Oak? Oak! Oak trees have acorns. There she blows! The transfer pass! Finally made it. Been a long time, long time. One ticket, please! Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I could stay here for the night. Or at least wait till there's an aurora. But that could be a while. And I do want to be ready to go, ready to jump into that forsaken airfield right when that aurora hits. So, what I might do is I have enough cloth. If I get enough sticks, I could build a shelter closer to the entrance to the forsaken airfield. So I'm ready. I'm ready to pick up your signal tower or whoever or whatever is going on. I'll get you. So we'll do a little bit of stick collecting and we'll head on up the road and look for a nice place to set up shelter. Oh, I got some Padarmigans over there having a good time. Just here to pick up some sticks, not here to bug you. Just keep on doing what you're doing. We've got ourselves the supplies to make a snow shelter. Okay, let's just head on up. See if we can get close to the entrance before we set up camp and wait for that Rora. Where am I allowed to do this? Where will you let me? Here's good, I'll take it. Actually, maybe I do like this side better. But you won't let me. I shall build you. Excellent. There we go. Snow shelter built. Exit the transfer pass to the Forsaken Airfield right there. All we gotta do is wait for Aurora, pull out our radio, and get the hell off this island. Booyah! <sighs> and now we wait. Hope you come soon, Aurora. Hope you come soon. Well, that's not Aurora at all. And Snowy? I can't deal with that. Is it Aurora? Nope, it's just a clear winter night. A beautiful clear winter night. God damn it! Back to the shelter. Okay, well this is bunk. Now it's just dark and I'm out of water. Did I check this car? Wait, I didn't have to make a snow shelter. I could have just sat in this car. Ah. Oh, dang it. Is it happening? It is happening. Okay, pick up my water. Take it. Okay, see a snow shelter? You did me good. I see that Aurora. All right. Oh, heart's beating. Let's do it. Oops, wrong way. Let's do it. Okay. Thanks, Aurora. I'll get right on it. Let's go. Okay, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for your signal. I don't see it. Is the signal supposed to happen? <sighs> All I want is like a, a beep or two. Just to let me know that I'm doing it right. Wow. What a beautiful sight. That's crazy. Man. Yeah, just land a plane right down there. I'll pop on it. Get going. Okay, I guess if I don't make it to the actual bunker, wherever it is, then I should be able to camp up somewhere and catch it on the next Aurora. 
But if we can just bang this out, bang this out real quick, that'd be sick. Now I know I always say I don't want to see no wolves, but I especially don't when the roar is out. They get feisty. I don't know if I'll make it for the roar ends, but gotta try. We gotta try. Still nothing. Still nothing. Oh, cross your fingers, Doug. Cross your damn fingers. Jeez, I think this is the longest I've spent outside during an aurora. Always thought it would be cool to see, but not when it is paired with spooky music and crazy electricity. About halfway through the night, aurora's still here. No guarantees, though. No guarantees. A signal. If I don't get a signal, I'm gonna be a little upset. Also, does it have to be so windy? This is crazy. There we go. There we go. We got ourselves a signal. No way. Oh my goodness, if only this wind wasn't so gorse dang loud. I don't know if I'll be able to hear a wolf. Okay, just keep going, keep going. Step by step. The wind's getting a little better. I can start to hear myself again. Oh jeez, is it gonna be up there on the cliff? Uh-oh. Oh, this is a steep hill. Can I make it? Oh, that'd be so great to just make it. This has been such a long journey, I just wanna go home. Oh God. Oh God. Just let me get home. Don't see any signs of danger. Just following the ticks, following the ticks. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, show me your bunker. Okay, wolves? Any wolves? No way. Holy cow! Oh my goodness! That was it, my first, my first kill. No, second kill. First kill with a gun. Gotta reload this baby, that was a close one. You can't say I'm this close and then just pull that out on me. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You tried to stop me. You tried to stop me from getting here. To where I needed to go. Okay, let's figure this junk out. This has got to be it. This has got to be the last bunker. Bunker Omega. Did it. I got to Bunker Omega. And the whole time I had a flashlight and I forgot about it. Whoa, this one has stairs. So cool. Okay, newsprint. Yeah, we're gonna do some looting. Whoa, this is a big one. This is a big one. No way. This is crazy. That was just one little wing of this place. Wait. I don't even. I don't even know where I am anymore. Okay, let's take a look down this way. Whoa. Little workshop? Medicine? We'll take a look at this transcript in a sec. Jeez. Got some kind of... What the... What is this, like an armory? There was, there was bullets in there. Oh, food and water. That's what I need right now. Been using most of my food just waiting. Just waiting for a... Aurora to happen. Wilderness kitchen, that'll be great. What is this? Security chief's rifle holster? Amazing. If only I had a rifle. Well, let's put some of this stuff away so that we can walk around. And then we'll take a look at these logs. There we go, interview transcript. I need to know what happened to this guy. 
Entry 17, Project Medical Officer. We have attempted various psychological interventions with the team members. Interviews reveal that the deeper the recall exercise, the greater the distortion. Consolidation failures appear in each patient, no matter the subject content. So far, these have yielded little actionable data. We do, however, hold out hope for a treatment strategy to apply away from their work environment. Proximity to the site of exposure is my last best guess. Behavioral changes are becoming more alarming. I will be including the following transcript excerpt in my summary report to be followed with project leads before team extraction, should it occur. We're almost finished. Please stay calm. Where has your mind settled then? Focus on the last image, please. We just want to get out. To burn it all down. <laughs> or did we? <laughs> I had it there, but I lost it again. I, ca I can't remember what it was. He said he'd stand with us if something went wrong. What, what did we do? What did they make us do? They can't get away with this. End recording. Okay, what's going on? This is getting more alarming by the second. Behavioral changes? What are they doing to this guy? What, what, what is this gadget? What is going on? Okay, security chief's log. Where are you at? Okay, here's what's hopefully the last piece of the puzzle. Whatever happened here, it's not a virus. Or any known pathogen. At least that's what the doctor tells me. There are no visible injuries, only invisible ones. My symptoms have just started, but they track what the others have gone through. Things are starting to get fuzzy, just like with them. Faces I can't remember. Like an old photo, blurry around the edges. Crumbling. The few men left up here can't be trusted to care for themselves. We've had to lock them in their quarters to keep them from wandering off. We tried going a different way, more psychological. We had a little luck at first, and then it all collapsed again. Rudiger hasn't been back to see us since we took the machine offline. <laughs> I'm struggling myself, and holding out for the resupply he promised. Will it get here in time? I've changed, somehow. The men, the medical officer, all of us. But not him. Not Rudiger. He'll want the research. It shows some bizarre benefits, even if it's come at a price. Rudiger found what he was looking for. <laughs> he can keep it. Whoa, there we go. Finish the void. Finish this mystery. Rudiger, you stone-cold bastard, what have you been up to? Well, doesn't much matter to me. Cause I'm getting the hell out of here. Oh, come in, you can't hear me. Hello, is anyone there? Sorry, I just woke up from a uh, snooze. No way. Hello, can you hear me? Oh my god, you don't know how happy I am to hear someone else's voice. I crashed my plane weeks ago and Stop, I... dog, stop. You, know, you don't know what you're talking about. You have no clue. You need to listen. <laughs> you need to listen to me. This isn't over. It's not over yet. What? No. No, 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 no. I got the radios working. I investigated the bunkers. This should be it. I should be able to call for help. I should get to go home. You're not leaving this island, Doug. You've dug too deep. So you might as well keep going. Keep going. Keep going. How? Where? What the hell is going on? I don't know what's going on either. I'm just a mysterious stranger. That's the name my mother gave me. Now look for a gadget. It's called Rudinger's Gadget. Or maybe it's a Ridinger's Gadget. Depends on how you pronounce it. In any case, you'll find the answers you seek there. Or not. Either way, we'll find out. Why? You haven't even told me who you really are. There's no time for questions, Doug. I'm the one who's in charge. Keep going, just keep going, 
and uh, use a stim if you have to. And remember to like and subscribe on Gaz's channel. You know, uh, if you don't, it's uh, the machine's not going to work. So just make sure you do that. You need to keep going. And remember to subscribe. Wait, how, how does he know my name? And what the hell's a Gaz? I'm not done here, am I?